very excited for this match. If I knew how to put my headphones on, we would have been think in this a lot man sooner. with as much commentary experience as Lord Links himself would be able to put a headset on. No, he's struggling. He's uh, struggling with that tech. Ear you know, things are flopping into my face in the whole in the whole nine. But all right, you so we got to the size of Mr. Freeze's head. I know, right? Well, uh, my head's bigger than his. All right, insider so. information. So we got light and pug west, man. This might be the, the match I'm most excited for in the whole tournament. You know what? I think you're right because it's these guys so are good. became fast friends after a couple of uh, comms events. Um, a lot of like sparring back and forth, and <laughs> they really like each other. And when you see like two really competitive people playing, it's um, you see a little spark of um, that rivalry, the fun one-upmanship, you know. And since the game's inception, Pug's been like top of the food chain in New England and yeah. light over the last like six, eight months. It's just yeah. rapidly like eating crawled, everybody. Just flew up. Oh yeah. Just, just tearing people apart. Yeah. They... So he's the new breed. Yeah, yeah, he definitely. Pug's the old guard. He's the new breed. So I like, like how um, you know. Top of the food chain is uh, Mark here, and then we have Fox here, who actually has to eat, you know, as a hunter. Yeah. He's doing his thing. And, you know. Here in the up smash, let's go. That's Not right. going to take the stock. Mark's going to be able to get back on stage pretty uh, easily, though, there. Dancing Blade's ah, going to take the stock yeah. of the ledge. Now, I know previously um, Pugwest says he doesn't use the Fox, but Light was able to show him up on that one. Yeah. So you get but, to see, like, the actual struggle here. No tech on that, so he was punished. Up, air dodges the up air, air dodges again. So he air dodged immediately two times to see if Light can make an adjust to that. Air dodged the third time immediately as well. See so oh. if Light can maybe adjust and try and get a landing up air. Oh. Down tilt. Oh. Pretty tough. He's Mark's on. edge guarding is very strong with Fox's linear recovery. But Light's well, doing almost, a really good know. job mixing up and, and, and pressuring. You know, Pug has to shield, otherwise he can get, you know, running up. There we like go, that. like that. <laughs> and then exactly the previous like time, that. Light was able to get a good grab. Yeah. It was, light, um, giving him the scorpion. Get over here. Now he's got to, um, go to the percent yeah, again and get these kills. If he can. He's got to get back to the stage first and nope. foremost. Nope. 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 Oh, smash. That, that sentence ended. Smash. Smash. I think the real problem with the taunt was that he taunted away from the stage. Yeah, he you know. Taunt but the taunt towards the stage. The taunt definitely was the heel here. Um, yeah, no, he was already far gone. The way um, the way he was building a percentage was just not fast enough, not aggressive enough, not able to stay in on the inside. After enough. yeah, after getting uh, the tables turned on him in the first stock, yeah, and losing the stock when he was ahead, uh, he had to struggle coming back. But yeah. game two's gonna be on town. He's gotta use these platforms Hugs to advantage. Mark, just doing, doing things, pressuring him to the ledge, reads the high recovery, reads the the timing, the timing, Duke, the timing. So far, all Pug this game, all the stage control, all the damage, pressuring the landing options. Light's got to reevaluate his approach game and, and... Um, yeah, definitely. I think he's, um... Nair gonna force him off stage. Pug is driving off Neutral of Fox's get up. speed. Ooh, okay. Complete miss, but he's back on stage. Thank goodness for that. Now, can he get any percentage? He's got 100 damage speed right now from Pug West. Oh, yeah, I know. He's got to call the stock of death or whatever. He's just got to build, like, go for broke 100%. Use his rage to his advantage. Do something. Boy's got to get in there and put some damage on this man. That all being said, all it takes is one forward air off the stage into a footstool. Mm -hmm. I mean, go, I, I, don't know how, I don't know how many um, opportunities he's going to do that against Pug. Gets in through the, uh, through the down tilt. There we go. Now this is a respectable. This is this is the juggle scenario that Light has been looking for. Not gonna nope. get it. Gets out of the dancing blade though. Eighty-seven percent. Looking yep. really good right now. Oh, the good tech. tech. Yeah, like like you can always count on like the tech. There we go. And he oh, turned wow. around with it. Up okay, there. there we go. He's back in this. He's using his rage to his advantage, able to get him get those knockbacks uh, pop it off a little bit farther. Yeah. And poof, throw. Good little pummel to an up throw and even it up. Now he's got to definitely stay ahead. Try to um talk, knock the boy off balance. Pretty close. First hit went to light in this stock, but uh, it ain't about the first hit. It's about the last one. That sure is the truth, and especially in Smash Four, how things you can you can be in control for like the full five minutes. First stock was 114 to 14. Exactly. And 114 side got the first kill. So it can it can, it can turn around any quick. Yeah. I like that. Light went high on that recovery. Made Using him the up air to get back on stage. Okay. No tech on the platform is going to get punished for it. Goes high on that. Foxes like doing that, the jump to, to the side B. So it'll be interesting to see if he uh, if makes any adjustments. He, went, he did. He did. He read that he 
Okay, oh, you're back on stage. Air, nice time, nice. Uh, he has bad timing on Pug's side. This is very even right now. These both have, both of these characters have really good self potential. Uh, almost Stopping any situation. Recovery. Yep, this is very even. Pug. Yeah. Uh, and up tilt to up air could take this. He yeah. is gonna take Yo! it. Yo, hold on. Get your crystal ball out of here. You don't do this. You don't do this voodoo crap. Oh, like, let's go. <laughs> oh my god. That was awesome. Yo, okay, what there a, we go. This is such a fiery matchup. I know! It's so fiery. There's it's just the like, fact that these characters have decent reco like, good recoveries, and they can kill each other. It's like, the, the, punishes the best are in insane, all the world, the kill you know? power is insane. Yes. The flashiness is on point with both of these, not only characters, but players. Yeah. These two guys just think... They like the style. They like the style. They like to, they like they to like the show style, you know, they look like two video are. gaming bums playing a game anyway. Oh my god, these you know, bums are fun to watch. These bums care. are great! Let's have a hobo fight. Yeah, Classic right. bum fight. Kid, put a game you control in my hand and I'll show you a whole new world. I've seen some things when I was oh your age. Oh my god, this pressure from light is so... <laughs> it's so brilliant. It l oh. I didn't get the pivot. It's looking so it good right that, now. If you got the pivot into that up tilt, I would I would start picking up Fox right now. I mean, you should pick up Fox, but Fox will feel like he's, you're running through a bowl of jello when you first pick him up. Nah. Fox was so slow when you first start playing him. As people thought he was a, really a defensive he's, character he's when this game first came out. Slidiness. Yeah, he does have a, um, a really good slide. Not too slidey, but just enough to get in there. So he went high with another side B. He's going high now, so he's probably going to now re return to going low with the side B's and then facing the, the down tilt. Mm -hmm. The forward air, um, giving him a lot of gas mileage right here. The up tilt. Got, the, got the weird spot of the up tilt, so he went in too far for the up air. I would so say he went low. low. He went low. 100% wrong call to go for the up smash. He went low again down. into the down tilt. He's going to go. See, this is the this consequences of a bad call. That going for the up smash when he was arcing back down to the side of the stage, that totally awesome reckless. Stage control got him into the punish game. Got him. Yep. One hundred percent could to, not get out. You have to maintain the center stage against Mark. This edge guarding is just so crisp, and especially oh. against someone like. Oh Pugmash. wow! Nice. That being said, not being in neutral air to up smash. Yes, but did you see him slow his momentum as he jumps to Nair? That was actually it's because you got to get the soft hit of it. Yes. Otherwise, he'll have been able to pop to the ledge. Probably super key right there. there. Take notes, people. Take Dancing notes. Dancing blade. The Dancing subtleties. Blade. Dancing blade. Free damage. No do like little to no knockback. It's wonderful. It just links into itself so well. Neutral getup gonna get punished. Okay. Another neutral getup. Um, what? Up and he gets back in. Oh my god! The dolphin slash to get rid the of all the trickery. The dolphin slash is just like a oh. panic. It's the panic button for Marth, So. Oh, oh, I, I, able to go low enough. What was those and drag hands? He was able to go low and ride the ledge. Went okay. high, clanked at that one. Oh, okay, huh? See. It actually um clanked as his hand I was like coming that. above his face. I like that. Pretending he was gonna go to the platform and then side be back to the stage. Okay, these combos super Light crisp right now. It, putting it on him here. Back to neutral. Into a forward air. He's gonna live it at 136. Can he recover? He's gonna get down tilted. Yes, he's back. See, up air. Oh, up there up. we go. Up air gonna get it. Up throw. Up throw gonna get it. Thank you. All right. So what we need here is you guys in the audience to play the soundtrack of Initial D because these guys are going way too fast. All right. It's crazy. You know, have you ever seen Initial D? No, I haven't. All right. Initial D is a um, anime about street racing. Yeah. And um, it's like 80s, super. Oh no, I know exactly what school. you're talking about. Yes. Okay, yeah. These these guys are pushing the limit 100%, doing the most reckless, crazy things, but looking so good while doing it. It's crazy. I wouldn't say, you know, I guess I could equate it to um a downhill battle on a mountainside, drifting. There's just so much. <laughs> I know. Behind both of these guys, it's like two. They're like well freight trains. Machines. They're like freight trains off the tracks, just in a death spiral, like going down a cliff. <laughs> you know, that's how I feel like a double derailment, and they're like they're not that on a bad. Cliff. They're just not that bad. I mean, that looks like a that's a trainer. That's a literal train wreck. And like, oh no, one of these freight trains make it out alive. <laughs> that's a new movie. Oh my god, cult classic instantly. Yeah. Listen, ladies and gentlemen, strong is. I'm just gonna like. Give human attributes to freight trains. Thomas I mean, the Tank Engine style. Faces. Thomas the Tank Engine? Is that song running in the 90s, I think, or is that something else? Shut up! Yeah. You don't know me! You don't know anything about me! Um, and it seems the bot is down at the moment. So we got the man on the keys, Ajax. Shout out to Ajax for posting links in the chat when people need them. Light touching things, ruining things. Drizzt's gonna have to come over and drop the elbow on him. 
It's gonna turn into a wrestling match. This is like... Is this like the momentum breaker? Like yeah, down, he's got he's got to like send it back to neutral. Just, like, shut the TV off. And, yeah, like, walk get up, around. go to the bathroom, take a break. You know. Now he's Light's dancing. Getting his dance on though. He's... I mean, I wish I could have shown you guys that. I think he's I think he's waiting for the restroom. Uh, yeah, he's waiting for the restroom. I think so. Oh, he's got to wash his hands. That's what he got to do. His hands are clammy, sweaty. He's got to reset his hands. You you sure you don't want to reset your hands? Knees weak, arms are heavy. Ramen on his sweater already. Mom's spaghetti. Hands are clammy. You wouldn't have thought his hands were sweaty without Chris coming to stuff. His follow-ups are real. Yeah, it's... He needs, he needs to micromanage every little action. As you guys saw... He was paying attention to every single frame of everything he was doing. Homeboy is on point and he needs his hands to work with him. Somebody, somebody volunteer themselves as tribute to be rubbed on. No, he got some hand sanitizer which will dry him right out. He got too much hand sanitizer though, now he's rubbing it all over his body. Oh, uh, they should have given us the name of 2016 music. The Dreamland for game four. Hug uh, West wants to close out the set. Slight looking up for game five. Alright, back, looks like... back, up tilts. Okay, two up tilts. Um, couldn't get up the tilt. pivot on that one, but couldn't yeah. get the rapid jab. Oh, yeah. wow, got the tip. Oh, Tip low percent, not gonna kill. dodge back to the ground. Pug mm -hmm. okay. is is absolutely a fan of the shield breaker, and we'll use it. Uh, get you know, kind of get up a lot yeah. off the ledge. And Pug's getting a lot out of these uh, blade dances right now. What's up, actually? Garbage? Pug's getting a real good cover. Okay, okay, there we go. Nice combo, nice confirm, and ooh, the pivot back. Yeah, there, there was uh, someone in the restroom, so. There's only one restroom after yeah. garbage. One day there'll be a UG with two with two restrooms, and then you'll know we made it. Oh, big time. Oh, He's gonna there get we the go. Okay. okay. Let's go. Let's go. Light's first stock in his favor. Stock, yeah. He's at 96%, so nothing to sneeze at just die. yet. Any tipper can kill him here. Yeah, really. You can get the Nair tipper, you can get a forward air tipper, any tipper. Give him all the tippers. But oh, down, okay. down air, forward air. Oh, he oh. read the air dodge too. He just couldn't get the setup on the ground. Not close enough. Did Clank with the high, high recovery side beat, but the dancing blade and PII are going to get the Dancing blade? Dancing mileage. Good okay. nair. Good yeah. nair. Definitely. Shields that dancing blade. He's right? out of range though and gets stabbed in the gut. That two brute. That's the floor there. There we go. He's staying in there. He's staying as close as he possibly can. Dolphin Blade trying to reset the pace. Um, obstacle back through the platform. Does not want to have a uh, fox underneath him. And Light, um, Light is doing a good job holding the stage here. Yes, he really is. Which you have to do. I mean, he doesn't want to be in disadvantage state against Mark. He's doing a really good Red job the juggling. Got just a little bit of the up smash. Not the, not the sweet spot. Oh! Gets a down smash there. Bug able to make it back, no problem. Up throw. Man, uh, no follow up. Got to go to tried the to F smash him. He's gonna lose the stage though. Very dangerous spot to be in. Oh my goodness, these edge edge guarding situations. Oh, high. you have to go high. One high. Okay. Missing the two frames. Can he come back? That's the real question. Real question. Okay, he's on stage. Oh my gosh, the floor they're gonna send him right back off stage. Oh my goodness! No! It's too low! Love.